subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon so that you get notified whenever I am hello everyone welcome back to my channel so in today's video i'm going to discuss about the various factors that affect rigor mortis what rigor mortis is is already discussed in my previous video i provided the link in the description box you can go check out that video also if you want this ppt then you can go visit my website i have uploaded this ppt along with all the other ppts over there so uh, you can go check that out i've provided the link in the description box so let's get started now there are many factors that affect rigor mortis but the major factors that influence the onset and the duration is the environmental temperature and the muscular activity along with that there are other factors also so they are also discussed in this video so first let's study about the first factor that is the environmental temperature now at higher temperatures what happens is that the rigor mortis comes early and passes off early now in my previous video i've told that rigor mortis starts then it stays for a certain time and then it goes off so in case of higher temperatures what happens is that the rigor mortis comes early as compared to the normal temperature time duration and it is going to pass off also early whereas in cold temperature that is if the temperature is low it is going to come off late and it is going to stay for longer period of time now if you talk about another factor that is the muscular activity so if there is some kind of violent exercise prior to death then it may hasten the onset as well as the disappearance of rigidity. So if there is some kind of fast muscular activity before the death, then it is going to speed up the process of rigor mortis and it is going to come off, come early and it is going to disappear also early. Also, the another factor is mode of death. That is, the rigor mortis can come early or it can come late on depending depending upon how the death occurred like for example the early onset of rigor mortis is going to occur in all these cases like for example if the death has occurred due to some exhaustive or wasting diseases like cholera typhoid tuberculosis cancer the rigor mortis is going to come early other than this violent deaths like cut throat electrocution firearm lightning injuries are also going to fasten up the rigor mortis process then if the death has occurred due to poisoning with strychnine organophosphate insulin or hcn or if the death is due to fatigue or exhaustion or heat stroke then also the rigor mortis is going to come off early now let's see when it is going to be late so it may be late in cases of death due to death due to asphyxia hemorrhage cold refrigerated bodies in refrigerated bodies the uh, um, onset is going to be late in paralyzed muscles in pneumonia other than this another factor is build of the person so it is going to come early and it is going to pass off early in thinly built subjects with weak musculature so if the person is thin and lean the rigor mortis is going to come early and it is going to pass off early whereas in cases of people who have strong musculature it comes off late and it is going to stay for a longer time period also rigor mortis is going to depend upon age of the person rigor mortis does not develop in a fetus of seven months of intrauterine age the rigor mortis is not developed in the seven month fetus the reason being that there are very few muscle fibers in that fetus and these muscles cannot contribute to the degree of stiffness that is required for rigor mortis hence there is no rigor mortis in the case of fetus that is less than seven months old in healthy adults the rigor mortis it develops slowly but is well marked it is weak and it comes early in children and elderly so these were all the factors that affect rigor mortis i hope you understood this video if you have any doubt you can let me know in the comment section and i'll try my best to give the possible answers to your questions please like share and subscribe to my channel also hit the bell icon so that you get notified whenever i upload a new video thank you for watching